welcome to a new vlog. I was planning on vlogging a little bit earlier in this car ride, but I have been so car sick. It has been a minute since I've been this car sick, but oh, it's horrible and I don't even have my little ginger candies with me. I have nothing. Um, but anyways, um, we are just arriving at Yorkdale Mall because today I'm going into the Dyson Boutique um, to try out their styling session. So essentially you can book appointments with stylists at the Dyson Boutique, which then you'll be able to try out all the different products because I do want to try out the new Dyson Airstraight and the Corral. I kind of want one of them, but I'm unsure as to which one is better suited for my hair um, and honestly before like spending that amount of money I want to be able to try it out on my hair so that's what we're here for today and then obviously a little bit of shopping um, in there since we're at the mall already but um, priority number one is definitely going to be to get a tea or something to aid my um, car sickness because it is it's it's not good right now it is not good <laughs> So I think I have an appointment with Katrine, who is the store manager and she's a stylist that's gonna be helping me today try out some of the different products. Now I've just curled my hair with um, my Dyson, but it's been a couple days, so it's quite fallen out now. Um, so it'll be a good way to see how the products, um, how the different tools work on my hair. So I'm very excited. First things first is there is a new like coffee shop, matcha shop in the mall. I forget the name. Um, the symbol is like a percentage symbol, but I'm gonna get a matcha latte before I get to the boutique. Hopefully that cures my <laughs> car sickness and nausea a little bit. Um, it's this place. I don't know if you can tell. Oh, oh, okay. So it looks really busy. Do you think it's we have time to stop in here? No. Okay. Okay, we're gonna do it after. I don't think I have time to stop in there. It is we're late, apparently, so. beautiful in here but I'm just waiting for one of the stylists to come out and then I can sit down but it's so cute they've got these like little stands you've got the air wrap there air straight there hi <laughs> hi how are you good how are you every time we're going to put it on it's honestly cleaning because it's low enough oh okay so um this machine is worked by this you know maybe they think this one is at home because the air air put like on this okay so one side is blown out of the water here. Why this plate inside is hot enough to flood the So one side is blown out of the water inside the plant of the So like to dry. Wet and dry. Okay. So for the wet one, you have three temperature settings. Yeah, 80, 110, 140. And then for the dry, you have 140 and then boost. Okay. So let's say for the wet, you will have more air density okay. to blow dry faster, gotcha. but less damage. And then for the dry, it's more heat, less air density. Gotcha. So it's harder to flood.
everyone. We finished up at Dyson and it was all great. But we are now at Holt Renfrew and I'm looking for a few things. One, some cardigans to kind of travel comfortably in and also some jeans specifically. So you see like the most high maintenance thing. But I want a high-waisted cropped wide leg dark denim. Um, kind of like a dark wash like that. So I'm just browsing around. I'm gonna hit Mother and Paige, because Paige, I love their denim. It's some of the best. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. And just see what other little things I can find. <laughs> because I ordered food uh, from Uber Eats and it hasn't arrived yet. It's actually like delayed. So I'm having this Nature Valley sweet and salty salted caramel chocolate granola bar to curb my hunger a little bit in the meantime. I feel like I used to always eat granola bars and now I hardly ever do. So good. Probably not good for me, but that's okay. <laughs> Also, something very exciting came in the mail today, and I'm going to show you in a minute. But in the meantime, I have a new fragrance to show you, which I just discovered. Anyways, as I was saying, I went to a little party the other night for Kelly in Paris, and I was really excited because, well, A, I love fragrances, and B, I've never really um, smelled very many of the Killian um, fragrances and the only one I ever smelled I was a bit thrown off because it was really really sweet and you guys know how I feel with sweet fragrances it is not my thing but at the event they had all the fragrances laid out and they actually had them um, sorted by citrusy fragrances floral fragrances and then I think it was like musky or woody fragrances and of course you know that that's exactly where I went for um, and I found one that I really liked Although I have a bit of a bone to pick because I'm a little disappointed in the name. It is called Dark Lord. What a horrible name. <laughs> when I posted this on my Instagram, I was like, I'm going to call it Dark Lady from now on because it's not only men that can wear the like smoky woody fragrances, but this fragrance smells like, like expensive leather. It's so good and it is so luxurious, so like smart and sexy. I absolutely love it. If you're looking for like, honestly, I'm gonna say a nighttime, but I've been wearing this during the day. I've been wearing this all day today. I've just reapplied it because I love it. Um, most people I think would wear this at night. I think you can wear it whenever you want. Um, it's so good. Definitely check out Killian, especially their like fragrances catered to men. They are so, so good. Um, anyways, okay, let's get to the good stuff. Let me show you what came in the mail this morning and I opened it up and immediately put it to charge so we could test it out together. But what arrived in the mail was my new Dyson Corral and you will have seen me, I think earlier in the vlog, I went to the Yorkdale location to test out not only the Dyson Corral but also the Airstrait which is the new one and i loved my experience in fact it's something that i recommend anybody to do if you're you know looking to buy new dyson products because you know they are investment items in your everyday life especially for your hair um and so being able to test them out and kind of be taught how to properly use them what not to do um i think it's really really awesome so at the store you saw me try the airstraight and the corral and i was kind of choosing between them because I love the concept of the air straight and I already had a flat iron at home. So essentially the air straight, what it is, is a very condensed hair dryer. So it's going to give you that straight blow dried look. And that tool is really catered to someone who wears their hair straight. And the reason it's catered to someone who wears their hair straight is because it's going to be really, really good at preventing damage. Obviously it's not using any sort of intense heat plates. So the temperature of the air and the heat that is being applied to the hair is going to be much, much lower. It's also really great because you can use it on wet hair so you can get out of the shower and just dry your hair, which I think is kind of genius. That was like the one selling point for me where I was like, oh, how nice would it be to just like get out of the shower, you know, towel dry your hair and then use the air straight. And then she tried the corral on me and it was kind of like love at first sight. Let me show you. So let me give you a quick guide through here and then we're gonna use it because I wanna see if I can give myself some nice loose waves for tonight. You get the straightener and then you get the cable 
and a little charging station. So it's really cute. So what you do is you can plug this into the station and then when you put your flat iron on there, you can see it beeps at me and it's telling me that it is charging and you can also see how much it's charged. So let me see if I can show you. There, you can see it's fully charged. Sorry, that was hard to show you. Um, you can see it's fully charged. If you didn't want to charge it on the charging station or say it's like low battery, you can always plug it in. Again, it's gonna charge and you can use it um, however you want. But I love the fact that it's wireless. Guys, as a woman, not being tied down to your desk, like I could do my hair over here, over here. I could lift it under my arm. I <laughs> think it's so cool. Maybe it's not that big of a deal, but you know, I'm sure lots of us have dealt with that like cable getting caught on something and having to like untangle it. I mean, I've always dealt with that. So anyways, you're like, Sam, get to it, teaching us about this product. So anyways, turn it on, really simple. Once it turns on, you'll see the little battery light and then you're gonna hit the plus or minus sign. So you can see here. So this here is gonna allow you to choose the temperature that you want, there's a little plus or minus. And unlike other straighteners, this actually isn't gonna go as high in temperature. And that's because of the plates. These plates are actually really, really good at conducting heat, meaning you don't need as much heat with this as opposed to most other flat irons, which I think is really, really cool. Oh, it just beeps and it tells you when it's ready and you get a little check mark, so you just heard that. So that's another really cool thing about this is the plate technology in here. So these plates, let me pull up the name for you. So these plates in here is actually really, really cool technology. I'm about to nerd out on you, but these plates here are a manganese copper alloy. So it's a really flexible metal. It's also a really, really great conductor of heat. So not only that, but these plates, as you can see here, actually kind of flex to your hair. So instead of clamping down your hair, they're actually going to kind of mold to the shape of your hair, which again is gonna cause less damage, which for me and someone who is constantly touching up the front of my hair, the less damage I can do there is amazing. So that's pretty much your little Dyson Corral. The other little thing that I thought was really important to mention was you can travel with this. So unlike the hair dryers or the air wraps that are not really compatible in other countries, so simply by getting an adapter, um, you'll be able to use this in another country. And then when you do travel with it, I don't know if you can see, you have a little home and a little airplane. What this does is you can actually take out the battery, turn it over and put it into airplane mode, which is gonna make this um, safe for travel, which is brilliant. I myself like it because when I'm working, I can you know touch up my hair in the car when I'm outside doing shoots. Um, and so yeah, it's just nice to know that you can travel with it because I know um, it's always a bit of a pain when you can't travel with something, but the fact that you can with this is awesome. So let's do their hair. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do one side first so we can kind of compare what one side looks like to the other. I am going to use a little bit of heat protectant first though. You guys know one of my favorites is the Jisoo Heat Me, Treat Me, Complete Me um, heat protectant spray. I just find this one to be really light. It doesn't like weigh down my hair. It smells so good. There we go. Hair is protected. I'm gonna give it a little bit of a brush through. Now, I had previously just given myself a very smooth little blowout, nothing fancy, but let's start parting the hair. Okay. Flat iron is all ready to go. Because I have been curling my hair with flat irons for years, the one thing I have said, it was like one of the first few videos I ever posted on my channel was, when you're curling your hair with a flat iron, something you wanna look for are rounded edges on your flat iron. Um, and that's exactly what this device has. And that's always something I've recommended and Dyson has nailed it. Um, my previous one it added a rounded edge, but it wasn't like this good. This one's nice and chunky which tells me it should give me a very nice curl. Now I want nice and loose curls, so I'm gonna move through the hair a little bit faster and I'm gonna leave about an inch to two inches down below. Oh, look at that curl. Let me see, got a beautiful curl. Okay, I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna do a slightly bigger piece just to see how that curls. Again, moving through a little bit faster because I want those looser curls and leaving about an inch at the bottom. Lovely, oh, so pretty. Okay, let's move on. 
Now, something that I really enjoyed at my little appointment um, was that the young lady was telling me all about how, you know, Dyson has really focused on not necessarily creating products that are good for everything you know it's not a tool that does it all it rather does one thing really really well that was really cool about the Dyson Air Straight is that its aim was for people who you know straighten their hair and if you straighten your hair that is the tool for you it's there to give you your perfect hairstyle um, without compromising the health of your hair which again at the end of the day that is the most important part. Now, the other thing I was expecting is that the corral was gonna be a little bit heavier than it is. It is heavier than most flat irons, but I will say it makes the curling weirdly easier. I'm not sure why, I'm not sure if it's something about the balance, but it makes it really, really easy to style. Another thing I'm gonna bring up before I do the rest of my hair um, is that this has 30 minutes of styling if you are at 100% charge. It takes me exactly 20 minutes to do my entire head of hair. So if you have less hair than me, then you're still gonna be able to do it with this. If it takes you more than 30 minutes, you might have to pop it on the charge again, but 30 minutes is more than enough for me to do my hair without having to plug it into the charger. So that's just a little, a little note, but yeah, you get 30 minutes of wireless styling, which I think is fabulous. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do the rest of my hair and then I'll get back to you once I finish this entire side. <laughs> I haven't even run my fingers through it. That is just right out of the curling iron or the flat iron, sorry. And it looks super pretty, but I'm not gonna touch my curls just because I wanna let them cool down and then I'll brush it through and I'll show you. But that took me like 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes. Not even, honestly. That was really, really fast. And again, you always remember when you're doing your curls, the slower you move through your hair, the tighter of a curl you're gonna get. The quicker you move through it, the looser of a curl you're gonna get. And I wanted that almost like beach wave, so I did a really quick pass through my hair. My curls have cooled down, so let's brush it through. I like using a nice wide comb. You can use whatever brush you want. All right, there you go. I am really loving these curls. They look very, um, just like hair salon quality, honestly. It's very, very pretty. Okay, should we do the other side? I feel like, yeah, this side's looking way nicer than this side. All right. Oh my God, look how pretty those curls are. I don't know if you can see in this light, but they're so pretty. Okay, I wanna do the other side. Where did my heat protecting go? Here. Sorry, I've had to turn on my fan because this room with all the sunshine hitting it, it gets so, so hot. I'm gonna quickly do this and then I can show you my full hair styled with the Dyson Curl. <laughs> all right, and that is both sides of my hair all done. I absolutely love these curls. It almost gives that like 20s. I just love the like beach curl. It looks so pretty. What do you guys think? I'm obsessed, I really like this. I'm just gonna shut this off one second. There we go. I am so in love. Now you could add um, some hair oil, but I feel like my hair is feeling really, really happy and healthy right now. So I am just going to leave it be. I love it. 